Is a dental crown procedure in your future? If you have a weak tooth or one that needs a bridge, your dentist may recommend one for you. Or if you have an extremely discolored tooth and teeth whitening or veneers aren't the best option, a dental crown may be just the thing to give you the bright white smile you're after. Either way, the dental crown procedure should take two visits to your dentist. The first visit is where most of the action happens. The second one is just putting the icing on the cake, so to speak. Dental crown procedure, visit one. During your first visit, your dentist will examine the tooth that needs a crown. He will first make sure it's worthy of a crown and, assuming it is, get down to business. First, your dentist will file down the tooth to prepare it for a dental crown. If your tooth is in really bad shape, he may need to do some filling work to build up the tooth to the point where it's big enough to support the crown. Your dentist will also take an impression of your tooth and its neighbors. These impressions will get shipped off to a dental lab. The techs at the lab are the ones who will create a permanent crown for you. Finally, at the end of visit number one, you'll get a temporary crown. This will protect your tooth until the real one is ready for you. Usually it will take a few weeks for the lab to craft your permanent crown. Dental crown procedure, visit number two. The dental crown procedure will be completed during your second visit. First thing the dentist does is removes the temporary crown. So that's the time to say your goodbyes and thank yous. Next, your permanent crown is put in place. Your dentist will put the crown on your tooth to make sure it fits like a glove. It doesn't affect your bite and everything just generally looks good. If any last minute adjustments are needed, this is when they happen. Once everything gets the thumbs up from your dentist, the dental crown is cemented in place using a special dental glue. And that's about all there is to it. Before you go though, there are two common questions about the dental crown procedure you may be wondering about. How long does a dental crown procedure last? This depends on your dentist, but in general, the first visit will last about 45 minutes to an hour. The second visit typically lasts around 30 minutes. Does a dental crown procedure hurt? Your dentist will use anesthesia during your visit, just something topical, so you shouldn't experience any pain during the crown procedure. When the procedure is over and the anesthesia wears off, there may be some discomfort. You may feel some sensitivity or soreness in the area, but it shouldn't last long. If you think you need dental crowns, it's best to find a cosmetic dentist near you to examine your mouth and discuss your situation with you. To find a local cosmetic dentist that specializes in dental crowns, search our listings at cosmeticdentistrynearme.com.